So I find this comment very comical. I don't like going back with useless piece of shit motherfuckers from fake fucking accounts. But I wanted to point this out. I, um, Lacey's House is a gender equality nonprofit for women's rights. And I have started fighting for children's rights and to end child marriages. So, but this is a perfect example. Uh, J.D. Vance or whatever his name is. This is what he did to uh, Camilla Harris supporters. And they said, uh, these are crazy cat ladies. This man is trying to invalidate me by saying, oh, I know you're not married. What does that have to do with anything? He's again defending Tiffany Haddish's disrespectful video where she even said that the store in Zimbabwe smelled. But she even said, that, oh, we don't even look, they sell dishes. We don't even sell dishes in the stores in the, in the United States. And then she tries to clean it up. She can't even pronounce the names of the packages. However, this fake fucking account is trying to come at my marital status. Wait a minute, pause. So that's just one of my husbands. <laughs> yes, I'm legally married. But anyway, it doesn't matter if I'm married or not. My opinion is not invalidated because I have a man in my life. But this is the fact that you can't comprehend anything. And I would never come and say, oh, it's because you don't have a woman in your life. More than likely you don't. But if you do, she's probably terribly abused. But this is sad. You are a teaching moment. And I'm going to even put this on my website because I want people to see how abusive and hateful men can be. Just because you don't agree with what I said, you've been coming at me for days but I'm glad that you gave me a teaching moment by being a piece of shit motherfucker because you show how women all over the world are invalidated because of their marital status and whether that they have children or not. And that is a teaching moment for the world. Just like Tiffany Haddish, she could have used her video as a teaching moment. She didn't. She used it as a moment to insult Zimbabweans and all Africans. But you're defending her for your life. Thank you. Thank you for being a teaching moment and a piece of shit motherfucker.